Police Commissioner Edward Caban's resignation took effect at 5 this evening, and former FBI agent Tom Dolan took his place. Near Guan's Rebecca Greenberg is at police headquarters with the very latest. Rebecca. Uh, hi there, Philip. That's right. New York City has a new top cop, and his name is Tom Donlin. The NYPD actually provided us with video of the swearing-in ceremony, which happened at 5 o'clock earlier this evening. Now, if you take a look, you can see Donlin accepting that role as interim police commissioner of the New York City Police Department. Now, Edward Caban officially resigned amid mounting discourse surrounding this ongoing investigation into several high-ranking members of the Mayor Adams administration. Caban is one of five people who had their phones seized, some, whom, some of whom had their phones ra or their homes raided rather over the last week. Now, this comes just one week after New York One learned Police Commissioner Edward Caban's phone was seized as part of this federal investigation into the NYPD and Mayor Eric Adams' inner circle. The mayor addressed the news yesterday, saying he was just as surprised as we were. Now, I spoke to a former member of the NYPD earlier today. She said that she believes that Don Lynn is up for the job considering his very impressive history with the FBI. And he also, she also believes that Caban will be remembered for so much more than this resignation. His career speaks for itself in terms of competency, and I don't question that at all. I want to just see if he could come in being, you know, federal and coming into the NYPD, which I've, we've collaborated with the federal government on so many investigations and task force. Like, we're very familiar with them. But I think he just really needs to come in and be a leader, but listen as well. I don't think that someone's career spanning decades with this department should be it's defined by one thing. And we don't even know if that one thing is true at this point. Now that Donlin has been sworn in, he is officially the third head of, he's the third police commissioner of the NYPD since Mayor Adams took office. So that's three in just over three years, which is concerning to some former members of the NYPD. But when it comes to Caban, lawyers for him say he is not the target of the investigation and plans to fully cooperate. For now, that's the latest in Lower Manhattan. I'm Rebecca Greenberg. Philip, I'll send it back to you. All right. Thank you, Rebecca.